hey youtube welcome back to my channel it's your girl nikki d Whew. i've been putting out some videos today as you can see i have changed my hair hopefully this is the last one so i kind of want to switch gears today and do something a little different instead of a product review a haul or something like that um i'm gonna say maybe we're gonna title this video top six fragrances for being classy grown and plus size <laughs> let's go with that for all you guys who are new here please go ahead and hit that subscribe button honey and turn those notifications on don't forget to follow me on my social media platforms i will link the links below or check out my older videos and you guys can like share comment and subscribe on this video okay I have six fragrances that are my staple fragrances. Um, some of them I have used the heck out of. They're almost gone. I need to get some more. Um, you all, I tell you what, you guys can also at the bottom comment and tell me what are your top fragrances that you like to use. Um, I find that I always have to layer fragrances because I perspire sometimes. I sweat, not all the time. Um, I also like certain fragrances because I like to linger in a room when you walk in the room you want to turn heads and you want to be the the best smelling person in the room so i have always thought i wanted to do that <laughs> number two when you have a certain smell you turn heads people notice you in a room it's a power move just like a power move for a man is to wear a certain color tie a red tie it's a power move a black suit a red tie it's a power move so for women besides makeup and hair a power move in a power statement when you walk in a room is a perfume so all these perfumes have been purchased with my own money. I've been wearing them for years. They're my grown woman perfume, grown women, woman, whatever. You know, it's not that Jessica Simpson at Paris Hilton. These are grown people perfumes. So let's get this started. I have them sitting on the floor because if I drop them, I will die. Um, let's start with my first fragrance. My first fragrance is going to be Chanel number no. five. This is the you do perfume this is not as they say toilet water <laughs> this is real perfume it's 100 percent perfume um y'all this fragrance right here is amazing it is a great fragrance for the fall the winter spring and summer you will turn heads with this and you do not need a lot of this this is it smells just so good it's more of a floral I want to say it's like a floral nutmegish slash baby powder type smell. You will turn heads, I promise, in this perfume. Like the bomb.com. My next one out of the Chanel family will be the Chanel Chance. This is also a hundred percent perfume. It ain't toilet water. <laughs> okay. This is a hundred percent perfume. Like it smells so good. It's it's like a floral type lotion type smell it smells different from the Chanel number no. five um, Chanel number no. five has been out for years chance is something that has came out within like the latest five to ten years so I'm, I'm, I'm I swear you will love this it's it's a good fragrance and it turns heads when you go in a room you of the Chanel fragrances you just need like maybe one or two squirts they last forever and they are so highly hoping it that you do not need much because too much would be an overkill and an overstatement but you will turn heads my next one is going to be the last little corner i have left and i lose lids to perfumes except chanel <laughs> chanel and gucci i don't know why but it's going to be this dolce and gabbana light blue it smells so good it's like a baby powder slash i just took a bath and woke up and went to work this morning fragrance this is the bomb y'all check this out and this is good for the summertime like i swear every time i wear this people are like what you have on oh you smell so good oh my god oh my god try to check this out these are like the essential perfumes for like oh anybody not just plus size anybody the reason why i titled this plus size perfumes is because most plus size people have 
hormones we sweat we perspire so these perfumes will block that and do not go and get no uh that aromatherapy stuff that work with your hormones and stuff sometimes that don't work on everybody because i know that sometimes those type of things stink on me they do not work on me so okay that's my third one my fourth one would be this versace yellow diamonds i have a lick left y'all just a lick oh my hair is all over the place a lick y'all when i tell you I was in Sephora one day and somebody sprayed this and I was so in love with it. It is always sold out at Sephora. I just have a lick left. I use it sparingly, but this is like my favorite, favorite, favorite perfume. It's like, it smells like candy and money and rich people and diamonds. <laughs> Check it out. I want to say I paid like 80 bucks for this or less. I'm not sure, but check it out. I got a little corner left when it's out. I'm going to buy some more. Okay. My fifth one would have to be, and I have had this a long time. I don't wear it all the time, but I love it. It is Chloe. The original Chloe. This I think it's the original. I'm not sure, but it smells so good. It's a fruity type floral smell like the bottle has even turned because uh, me putting on lotion and then layering it so the bottle is not like that but I love this fragrance this Chloe is like the bomb oh my god you when you walk in a room it's a unique smell that nobody else will notice you they'll be like mmm what is that try this one out I, I, I'm telling y'all y'all will like this one as well okay my fifth one that I am almost out of Lil Lick left <laughs> the little lick i don't know if y'all can see that it's gucci flora um don't sleep on this perfume because when i first got this i was like oh it stinks but everybody liked it on me and i kept spraying and spraying and spraying and spraying and spraying you will not trust me you will love gucci flora like mm, it's a soft floral scent um it's soft like so if you're going in a business meeting you don't want to overpower everyone this right here and it lasts all day will be like the bomb.com like trust me um and my last one that i also lost the top on is the original ellen tracy like <laughs> don't sleep on this either you can get this from like perfume mania if y'all have that um tj maxx sells it it's highly inexpensive it is like the bomb everybody when i wear this, this is my everyday perfume i wear this every day especially when i'm going to work that's why it's almost out but everybody loves this perfume there i was like what you have on and it's the original ellen tracy i want to say tj maxx might carry this for like 20 dollars or less but trust me you will love this this is an everyday perfume um, even I go to work, I move boxes around, I change lights, I perspire, and this perfume still is like 100% on me. Like, it doesn't come off. I, it smells great. Try this one out as well. Like I say, you know, to each his own, like, what type of fragrances you like. Let, you know, comment below. Let me know which ones you like. Um, I know, like, I say, I perspire a lot. Um... I love to smell good and you know I also have a thyroid problem which controls a lot of my hormones I take a lot of medicines for it so with that being said I have to always make sure I smell fresh I have an issue with not smelling fresh as in I smell fresh but I do not want to not smell fresh so let's just say that so I like to always smell sweet just like I got the bathtub and everything like that so you guys let me know what are your top fragrances that you like I will be purchasing all these again <laughs> let me know which ones you like comment down below and if you have some more ideas on videos let me know um, I'm working on some more ideas for you guys um, such as makeup tutorials which I don't know they're gonna be hard trying to film because you know your girl is just not computer savvy and it's a shame because I went to school to get certified for computers and I stopped using the certification and I guess it's like they say if you don't use it you lose it <laughs> so you know I gotta get back into that I promise eventually 
um yeah you know i was into web pages and designs and computer savvy and stuff like that so i'm gonna have to get back into that i'm gonna have to give me one of them dummy books books for dummies or whatever it's called so yeah i don't know but see you guys in my next videos and don't forget like share and subscribe follow me on all of my social media i do not post that much but when i post it's like epic it's really epic so <laughs> i love y'all bye